Hey, it's Clay on this be a video chart on ticker symbol FB Facebook. We will take a look at the 30 minute time frame. If you're not sure what I mean by 30 minute, I do offer an explanation video at that link. Also from a disclosure standpoint, I do own Facebook in my retirement accounts from the long side. So just keep that in mind as I go through the presentation here. Now, rough day today, obviously headlines came out. Uh, the market did not like those headlines. So you can see well above average volume. So definitely a lot of eyeballs gonna be watching this one going into next week. And really there's a couple of main levels here that really stand out. And these levels are not like some sort of great discovery on my part. So I don't wanna come across like this is some sort of unique ability that I have. I assure you, a lot of people that use charts, understand charts, are gonna be watching these areas. And I say all that because when a lot of people are watching the same levels and wondering the same thing, Call it a self-fulfilling prophecy, call it whatever you want. It can certainly produce some very dynamic movements. And the one level that there's gonna be all sorts of people watching is right up there at $220 as a potential breakout point. I mean, it's still Facebook, and it's still a tech stock, so you know people are still bullish on these things. So it's not exactly rocket science to think that there's gonna be people watching to see if this thing can level off, go sideways, and start to work its way up and get a break through that level. Now, of course, no such thing as a guarantee. My point here is that it's at least a valid and rational thought to have that if the price can behave in that manner and then work up there and get the break of 220, then that very well could create quite a bit of upside buying pressure. Again, guarantee, no, rational thought to have, absolutely. So 220, definitely gonna be one of those main technical levels that many will be watching in the event the price can push up through 220 next key level to watch would be then up around the 225 mark now as far as areas of support are concerned gonna have to squeeze down the chart here quite a bit because as you're seeing here it's been a long time since the price has been down this low so i get at the charts a little bit harder to see but next key overall area of support right now is right where the price bounced off of today at 215 and if 215 does not quite hold up the next level not until down around the 212.75 mark. So 215 is the mark that I'll be very curious about um, and you know, to see if it consolidates, you know, cause like I said, right now, yeah, it could go sideways and then start to work its way back upwards, but there's, you know, that's a two-sided coin, right? It could break down through that level. So you know, there's gonna be all sorts of shorts watching that level right there, wondering if the price can break through there. And if it does, then again, very rational thought to have that, that could create quite a bit of downside selling pressure. So we'll see what happens with it going into next week, but yeah, rough way to end the week. First off, thanks so much for watching the entire video. Real quick, before you go, I wanna invite you to a live webinar, web class, training, workshop, online event, whatever you wanna call it, but it will be me live revealing to you what I discovered that has allowed me to transform myself from being an employee to being my own boss, including how I had only one losing day out of 73 days in total. I'm going to cover three keys that have helped me unlock profitable consistency within the markets. The first key is super weird, but in a productive type of way. The second key is super awesome because it quite literally is wired into our DNA as humans, making it very easy to use. But in a cruel way, this becomes a pitfall for many traders. I'll explain it all though, including how to avoid the pitfall that it creates for some. And yeah, the third key, when you hear it, sounds way too, good, way too good to be true, but it's not, and I'll show you how it all works. Then at the end, I open it up for a question and answer session that is, again, totally live. Even if you can't make the live session, please still sign up as it will be recorded, and you can go back and watch the replay that I will send you. Click the image on the screen or click the link down in the description box so you can get the date and time and claim your spot, which I should note is limited due to the fact that this truly is a live event. If you have any questions, let me know. If not, I'll be seeing you soon.